Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'll talk about uh, Google uh, text to speech module which is given in Python. So using this module uh, GTTS uh, we can uh, convert a text into a voice or speech. You can save your text, uh, a limited length of text as, a, as an mp3 file or a WAV file and you can play that uh, uh, using your system okay so you'll see that so this is my channel Linux Unix AX so we uh, usually uh, 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 create uh, tutorials for Python and open systems like Linux self scripting so if you haven't subscribed it please subscribe so let's go ahead and uh, go uh, try to understand this module so GTTS uh, first of all you have to install it in your system so you can directly install it using this command pip install gtts okay so if you are if you are logged in as uh, admin so you have to go as admin first okay and then you have to type pip search gtts so you will find this uh, module uh, Google text to speech which is already installed in my system so if you haven't installed it just type pip install and then uh, g t t s so if you do this what you can do is you can do uh, minus u u upgrade so it will take you to the latest version okay So if I run this command, it will uh, install GTTS in my system. I think it should be uh, like this. Okay. So this will. Uh, okay. So it is saying that requirement already up to date. So this is already installed in my system. Okay. Fine. So once you have installed GTTS, which is Google Text to Speech. You are good to go so you open your uh, python prompt so, so once you install this uh, it, it is uh, providing you a command line interface as well uh, which you can directly run from your terminal so if you open this module gtts so if you just open the help of this module so you will find that it has a cli so which is which supports the command uh, command line interface okay so if you if you just close this python prompt and if you run this uh, gtts minus cli it is uh, it allows you to directly type a text right away at here hello how are you or something like that anything okay so once you type this and then uh, what you have to do is you can specify the output file name so where you want to save this file so let's say i want to save this output as uh, my voice dot mp3 so if i run this it will save it will convert that text hello how are you into a voice and that voice will be saved in your current directory so if you open that folder you will see that there is a voice file saved so you can directly open it using your player, any player that you have. Okay. Hello, how are you? So you can see it is playing. Fine. So this is one way to take convert your a text into voice. The other way is by by the module in the Python prompt. Okay. So here, once you import Python, sorry, Google Text to Speech. So here we have a class in this module which is called GTTS. Okay, so we have a class called GTTS which is used to uh, save your voice as, uh, as an audio. Okay, so what we'll do is uh, from GTTS we shall import. Uh, G capital T T S 
okay so in this one i'll this will instantiate this class will create an object of this class g t t s and here it takes the string whatever string you want okay so you can put uh, any length string okay let's say uh, hello my name is clark okay so it should uh, it should uh, take this text okay so now i have created this object so once you have this object what you can do is you can save this text as voice as a as an mp3 okay so here you have to specify the complete path or the file name okay so if you simply give the file name it will be saved right away in your current folder if i do like this it will save my voice so it will okay i already have one file with that name so it will replace that so now if i play this hello my name is clark it will play it will right away play that voice okay so right away you can play your voice like this okay fine so this is one way to play your voice you can specify uh you can you can play uh you can you can type any um, any length string okay i am a python developer working working as consultant consultant in hyderabad okay so if i do like this and if i save my voice let's give it some other name okay so i have one more file here right away so if i if i play this hello my name is clark i am a python developer working as consultant in hyderabad okay so it will play the voice fine so what if i want to play this voice okay so what you can do is you can directly run this command called mpg uh 321 and then you have to specify the file name that you want to play okay so this is my voice 2.mp3 so if Hello, i play my this this is clark i am the python developer working as consultant in hyderabad so this will play your voice okay so there is a uh, there is some text which is coming when i play this so there is an option called minus q which will suppress this text so if Hello, you type this my name this. is clark i am the python developer working as consultant in hyderabad so it will play your voice okay so this is how you can play your voice you can convert your text into voice okay and uh, okay so there is one more way which you can uh, use to play the voice you use the os uh, module so if you import this os and then there is a method called system which can be used to play any linux command in python okay so here you can specify your mpg321 this is a command and then you can specify the file name that you want to play that is another way to play your voice okay so this is my voice dot mp3 so this Hello, will play my name is clark okay so this will play your voice in the python so this way you can play the voice in the python script itself so that's how you can uh, create your text you can convert your text into voice and you can play that voice using gtps module thanks for watching guys that's all in this tutorial bye bye